Goodbye, house. Goodbye, Walla Walla. <laughs> You've been good to us. It's time to move on. Wrong one. As you can see, that says knives. And you are now standing in my knife shop in Mountain View, Arkansas, here at the Ozark Folk Center. I'm a full-time bladesmith. Some pants on. All right, I got some pants on. Uh, hold on, I'm indecent. All right, come on back. So when you're a full-time bladesmith, it's uh, <clears throat> so you want you want to be able to keep yourself limber. So before you start swinging your hammer, forging knives, you don't want to cramp up and ruin your shoulders and your elbows. So you want to do some stretches. Uh, maybe do a few few yogi poses. Now get your get your uh, uh, you're leaning up, you're gesturing uphill, lean, stretch out. Uh, do one of these numbers, pointing the guy down the street, that guy over there. And one of the more important ones, this one's called the paralyzed dog. It's a stretch. Uh, make sure you're good limber. Good. Uh. Ah. Ah. Good. Ah. Paralyzed dog is important. It'll keep everything all loose so you can be a great bladesmith. <laughs> 